Welcome Pisces, Sun Rising, and Venus. Today I'll be doing your love reading for August 2021. I'll be taking a look at your person's energies. This can be anyone that you're thinking about dealing with or connecting with. All right, Pisces. So let's see. What does this person wish they can tell Pisces at this time? What are their feelings for Pisces, please? Just give me one card. What does this person wish they can tell Pisces? energy so you've been thinking about me because I've been thinking about you we're connecting whoever it is that that's on your mind Pisces it, it, this is someone that you may have not talked to for a while or maybe it's been very confusing maybe on and off um, you may have been feeling really drawn to this person lately. Maybe you've been dreaming about them, thinking about them, and that's because they are also thinking about you and dreaming about you. So just keep that in mind, okay? I feel like energetically right now, uh, you two are very, very connected. But let's take a further look here. Let's see. How is this person viewing Pisces at this time? How are they viewing Pisces at this time? How is this person viewing Pisces? Eight of Pentacles, okay. Could be connecting with a Capricorn Virgo Taurus, does not have to be. But they are viewing you as someone who is working on something, okay. They may feel like you're either, you know, trying to make this work, or they may be viewing you like either working on your finances, maybe you're focused on your finances right now, Pisces. For some of you, this person may be viewing you as someone who's not really paying attention to them. Or maybe observing them. But not saying much, okay? So Pisces, only you will know if this is resonating with you. If you've been observing this person or maybe checking their social media or seeing what they're up to, like I feel like this person's noticing that, but it's like, okay, well, why won't they say anything though? Could be vice versa, but let's go ahead and clarify. How is this person viewing Pisces? Why is the Eight of Pentacles here? Forgiveness, okay. So this person wants your forgiveness. They do. Or you want their forgiveness, Pisces. I don't know. Only you know how, you know. Someone here wants forgiveness. Pisces, this, this could very much be you. They might be viewing you like possibly wanting their forgiveness, but not really saying much or doing much, just observing them. Or it could be, again, vice versa. But someone here wants forgiveness. Or wants to ask for forgiveness. Yeah, I'm really feeling the energy that you're probably not talking to this person. And if this is not resonating, leave it completely behind. Feel free to check your other placements. Let's take a look at how they're feeling for you. What are their feelings for Pisces at this time? What are their feelings for Pisces? Ace of Wands. They want a new beginning with you. Okay. Whoever, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy here. This person wants to have a new beginning. They have a lot of passion, a lot of love for you. Okay, Pisces? So, yeah, this person, they, they wish or they want a new beginning here. They may be take, thinking about the times that you guys were together, the times that you guys were intimate here. <laughs> and for some of you, this person has been like also uh, sexually fantasizing about you as well. Why is the Ace of Wands here for this person's feelings for Pisces? Pisces. Whoa, that flew out here. Yeah, but see, this one flipped over as well here. Could be dealing with a Libra. It does not have to be balancing the scales. This person wants to balance the situation out, bring things into harmony, okay? Um, deception. Interesting. So their feelings for you, it's kind of like they want... Now, for some of you, they may be deceiving themselves. Like, they do want in the beginning with you, but they're acting like they don't. Or 
they may feel like there might have been deception and disconnection and therefore they they don't know how to have this new beginning now i'm also picking the energy where this person may be committed already pisces either you or this person may already be committed so it's kind of hard to have this new beginning okay what action will this person take towards pisces what action will this person take towards pisces hey I was gonna say April. I don't know if April has anything to do with anything here. Yeah, really weird. I was gonna say April instead of August. So for some of you, April may have been significant or maybe this per person's birthday is in April. Okay, King of Cups. The action they plan on taking towards you is they're gonna come offering you love again. Okay, Pisces. This person, water sign, another water sign like yourself, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, they have a lot of love for you, okay? Not only are they very uh, attracted, attracted to you, like on a physically sexual level, but they also have a lot of emotion for you. And like the King of Cups doesn't play, okay? This is someone who, who knows what they feel. They know what they have to offer. A lot of love here, okay? A lot of love. And actually, once I finish this, I'm going to clarify the deception because that did kind of throw me off a little bit. So, but anyways, why is the King of Cup, Cups here for the action this person plans on taking towards Pisces? Yeah, Twin Flame. This could be a Twin Flame that you are dealing with. Could be an age difference. But there's a lot of passion here, okay? Definitely could be an age difference here. This person is going to come offering you love. 100%. Why is deception here for this person's feelings towards Pisces? Why is deception here? Ace of Cups, King of Pentacles. Give me one more. And the Nine of Cups. Wow, this person has mad freaking love for you, Pisces. Could be someone new that you met. Or maybe one of you started a new relationship. So now it's kind of hard to, you know, go back to the past here. Or this could, this could be someone new. This could be someone new that... Maybe things haven't have haven't been official yet. But this person, I feel like the deception may be that either one of you is already committed, could be both of you, but either one of you is already committed, so it's kinda like like, oh I love you, but I'm stuck with this person, or I love you, but I need to leave this person, or something around those lines, okay? But this person does have a lot of love for you, okay? You got two kings here, king of pentacles, king of cups, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus. You could be connecting with another, or with an earth sign or another water sign. But you're this person's wish fulfillment with the nine of cups. They want to be with you. But again, I'm really feeling the energy that one of you is already committed. Or, or someone here is in the way. Okay, so yeah, in a way this is deception, right? <laughs> like, it's kind of like, how do I say it? Or they may have been deception in the past and therefore that's why they don't know how to fix the situation. But you know, take whichever story resonates with you, you know, because I'm really feeling that either one of you is already committed or there was deception in the past. But at the end of the day, you are this person's wish fulfillment. They have so much love for you, Pisces. Could be another water sign here. I'm seeing water, strong water, fire, and you know, some earth. let's see what's your advice what's your advice when it comes to this person what's your advice pisces august 2021 love what's your advice queen of pentacles the high priestess that's you Pisces energy and the king or the two of pentacles. Okay, so seek enlightenment here. Listen to your intuition, Pisces. All right, again, more earth energy, Pisces as well here, but this is you. This is your energy where I feel like your advice is to listen to your intuition. What is it telling you? Again, if you've been energetic, energetically connected to this person, what is it telling you? You know, write down your thoughts if you need to. 
so you can so you can find how to balance the situation out or, or to a decision needs to be made i'm really hearing that okay i'm feeling the energy where someone needs to make a decision to either stay or go or or a decision between two people okay so seek the answers within yourself this month and try not to become or to not sorry not to become try not to come off as very uh don't let your ego get in the way okay spirit is telling me don't let ego get in your way or pride spirit is also telling me that maybe you or this person have been trying to show off something that they're not really feeling how do how do i explain that so for example let's say let's say you are in a relationship right Okay, let's say this person deceived you in the past, right? And maybe you're in a new relationship trying to show off how happy you are, but really you're not. This could be this person as well, but your advice is to not come off as something you're not. Don't try to show something that's not really true, okay? That makes any sense. Who or what is coming towards Pisces singles in love? August 2021, who or what? Okay, some of you may be meeting someone at a distance, Spirit is saying. Aries Leo Sagittarius. Okay, so you have new love coming in here, okay? Ace of Cups, Seven of Wands in reverse, Nine of Wands, Aries Leo Sagittarius, Pisces Cancer Scorpio. A lot of you, if you are completely single, not dealing with anyone, there's new love here. Okay, so don't lose hope, don't lose faith here. It's coming. Uh, it could be a Capricorn for some of you as well. Or it could be a new beginning in love. So I'll take it how it resonates. But um, you're, I feel like, you know, just try not to become so defensive. Try not to let past burdens affect this new connection. Okay, Pisces. But I do feel like you might meet someone also I'm hearing in a workplace or somewhere where you do not expect. Yeah, but I see an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or a Capricorn, or a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio coming your way here. You know, it's interesting, Pisces, because I feel like, it, and this is only going to resonate with some of you, some of you have, may have been feeling like, I give up. I give up. I give up in love. Like, it's just not, you might have been feeling really drained lately, or something around those lines, but... It's kind of like the moment you give up, that's when it's going to, going to come. Spirit keeps screaming at that, that to me right now. So the minute that you're like, I give up, like, forget this, I'm drained. Maybe you've had like seven heartbreaks, you know. Or maybe someone here failed you way too many times. And, and the minute that you, you give up on love, that's when new love comes in. That's when something that you don't expect comes in when it comes to love. Okay, yeah, Knight of Cups. And it's going to come in quick. So just be prepared, okay? But yeah, I'm really feeling the energy that the minute that you give up, that's when it comes in. Or that's, this is when something happens. All right, Pisces. Well, uh, if this didn't resonate, leave it completely behind. Feel free to check the other placements. And if you haven't already, please like, comment, share, subscribe. And I'll see you guys soon. Bye-bye.